So welcome back guys, today we're checking out the uh, uh, soda sail ship entry from Pirate Ray and as you can see this is a full on ship, full on sail ship, um, the Pirate Ray Solar Cap Horn and uh, I think it's a pirate ship as you can see he's flying the skull and, well he's flying the skull and crossbones, I'll say that. Um, it features fully connected plex door sails so if I just demonstrate that. I think I can do it with zero. Go on, go on game. How awesome is that? The sails unfurl. So anyway, we're gonna check it out with the sails up. As you can see, got some great visuals on this vessel. Oh my God, somebody put the sails up while I was in it. Okay, so as you can see with the sails rolled up, we've got uh, a little bit of a better view on the deck here. So if I just check this out, so we've got some more plex doors. I'm assuming it's gonna go down into the belly of the ship. We got a bunch of turrets for uh, defense, obviously. Got various little bits of detail all over the shop. What's this he's been using here? Are they wedges? No, they're hanging lights. Huh. From a distance, it makes it look like little glass. No, it does. From a distance, it looks like this glass there. Weird. Anyway, moving on. So we've got lots more detail coming down the actual, down the ship, and lots of turrets as well. So I'd say it's sort of like an authentic styled warship. Um, but yeah, let's take a look underneath. We've got some more turrets under here, which is awesome. Lovely detail on the front there as well. I like that. It's cool. And. Um, yeah, it's a little bit more Pirate Navy than uh, sort of a galleon, which is, you know, what people think when they think pirates, but but yeah, I love this. I really do. I really think this is awesome. He's used plex doors in quite a few ingenious ways. Let's have a look at what he's got back here. So it looks like uh, he's got a cap captain's bridge. I'm going to have to go and check that out. So yeah, that's the ship, so let's just get these sails back. Where are they? That wasn't a sail. Okay. There we go. Right, so we get the sails back unfurled. It's great how he's got them all the lines. He's even got the lines coming off them. <laughs> it's really nice, really nice work. So let's see if we can get a look down here as well. Yeah, this is looking real nice. So uh, I think we're going to try and get on board now. So we're going to take a little look around the uh, deck. So walking along here, we've got some turrets there. I suppose we'll head up to this end first. So off we go, up the ship, and like I say, the views are just epic from just looking around, you know, this is a really nice ship, and uh, what we got down here, we got fighters, fighters down here, tunnels, <laughs> storage, just sort of like random boxes, that's cool, more pirate fighters, quick look inside this one looks like a looks like a shuttle looks kind of like the Star Trek shuttle a little bit but yeah awesome and a little bed <laughs> let's see if we can go through here more storage plunder 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 storage <laughs> oh it's awesome if we go ah, and here's the pirate Ray himself so I've been checking out the plunder And I don't know where he's going. I was going up that way, but I think I'll just sort of follow him. Oh man, there's more stuff in here. Look, I can't just go off that way when there's all this stuff to look at. Where'd you, how'd you get in there? I reckon it's this door here. Yeah. What we got? We got a canteen. 
little kitchen up here we've got some plants and way out to the top deck let's go find the pirate the team speaks down tonight which is annoying because uh, when I'm in tab G can't can't see it can't see the chat but that's good because I don't want to see the chat <laughs> when I'm in tab G okay so as we carry on down into the main part of the ship keep on checking out crew cap cabins I think these are cabins yeah cabins and bunks what's in here a medical station must be a medical station the interior on this is excellent it's like this guy's actually spent more time on the interior you're real nice more crew quarters lots of crew quarters oh wow we got a bit of lag there controls we need to get this guy on chat so we can figure out I think we're gonna to have to re revisit this video because uh, it's just there's so much going on here I'm blown away just just crew a uh, room after room after room oh wow this is his version of a shower yeah that's nice oh god oh god oh god oh no what happened okay so I finally caught up and now we get to go and see the bridge. I hope to be, yeah, I'm definitely going to do this, this ship again. I'm going to try and get Pirate to come on and talk to us about it. Because uh, I'm really impressed. Really impressed with this ship. I love this quorum. I love how much detail people put into their interiors. It really pays off in the end, you know. Oh, a blast shielded control room. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. So that's the core room, we've got more crew quarters, more bathrooms. I love the colour coding system as well. I didn't understand it at first, but I think I'm starting to get it. And that's why I'd like to be able to talk to him a little bit about what he's done here, because this is epic. It really is. <laughs> it's really nice. So let's just check out the stats on this monster. Okay, so it's got a mass of 8,019 with a uh, length of 255, a height of 117, and a width of 55. The power is 137,882, and the uh, energy per second recharge is 1.14 million. Uh, it has a thrust of 12,000, and a turning speed on the X of 1.1, on the Y of 1, and on the Z of 1. The shield's 276,000. Uh, recharge six and a half thousand per second. Recovery three. Okay, so yeah, awesome ship. Thanks for bringing it along to see me, and uh, can't wait to see your next builds. And I'd love to do an in-depth interview, so uh, over the ship, uh, just to speak to you, really. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.